Hello guys, Jake here. Welcome back to another video. Today I've got for you another shots vlog as Aldershot take on Maidenhead United. So guys, since the last video, Aldershot have played two games. The first one was against Harrogate and that resulted in a 1-0 loss with Harrogate's goal coming in the 92nd minute. So an agonising loss in that one. And then in midweek we took on Bournemouth and that resulted in a 0-0 draw. So Aldershot haven't actually scored in their past three league fixtures. We did put three past Bromley, but that was in the FA Cup. So one thing's for certain, we need to start putting the ball in the back of the net in order to pick up a run of results. So guys, moving on to today's opponents, and they are Mainhead United, currently sitting in 14th place on 25 points, and all the shot just lingering outside the relegation zone on 19 points in 20th place. And I think I'm right in saying that Mainhead have both Shamir Fenelon and Bernard Mentz are obviously both ex Aldershot players. And for Aldershot, I think we, we can't settle for draws anymore. We need to pick up all three points. It's vital that we do. We're so uh, close to being in the relegation zone and we can't just settle for draws anymore. And as I said uh, just a moment ago, we need to start getting the ball in the back of the net. So hopefully we can pick up all three points today. I think we definitely need it and hopefully, I've said this before and we haven't really done it, but hopefully we can build a kind of a, a streak of games where we bring in some results and start maybe climbing a bit higher up the table and further away from the relegation zone. But yeah, hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to like, subscribe if you are new around here and let's go to the game. <laughs> This is the old stadium in the home of the Shots. Please welcome onto the pitch the match officials and the players of Maidenhead United and the Old Shot Town! The O2, 12 Alfie Whittingham, 14. Come on, Shots. Nice. 
pushing back. That's not oh, clear. So half time, all the shot nil, main head nil, and it was a decent first half of the shot, some good build up play, but like a lot of games this season, there just hasn't been a final product. And again, in a lot of games this season, in the second half, sometimes our performances have dropped off, but hopefully we can keep that up in the second half today and get three points. Let's see. Yeah. Go. Go. Go on, champ. Oh. 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 That light is right in the way. How have they come away with that?
Nice. Beam of light in the way, let's go. Come on, Max. Beam of light. So guys, full time, all the shot two, main head nil, two goals from the two substitutes, sees us pick up all three points. And like I said at the beginning of the video, it was vital that we got goals and got that three points today. And we did just that. And I've also seen a few people kind of criticising Danny for kind of his timing of substitutions, maybe bringing them on a bit too late for them to really grow into the game. But... Uh, both the goals coming from Harrison Paniatu and Alfie Whittingham, who both came off the bench. So I don't think anyone's going to be planning, complaining about that today. And we grew uh, into the game a bit in the second half. We did play well in the first half. And I said at half time that sometimes those second half uh, performances maybe just aren't up to standard. But uh, it was brilliant today. Two well taken goals as well. And yeah. Brilliant three points from the shots. So, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you are new around here. Share this video with your friends. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.